Welcome back to Fire Life. Uh, today I'm presenting an actual troubleshooting session for one of Fire Life's customers. Here it demonstrates how TCP three-way handshake knowledge helps us to troubleshoot post access issues. Uh, let's go to the session now. Hello, hi. Hello, good morning. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Yes. Yeah. So, can I share my screen? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Actually, uh, initially I thought it, it's a parallel token section <laughs> since you sent that uh, to the parallel token, but uh, no, no issues. Uh, yes, I, yeah, it's because like I tried to find like someone just for Azure VM configuration, but uh, unfortunately, like um, I didn't find anyone like with this description. So I thought myself, if like, you're able to, okay. to do Palo Alto firewall, then basically you will be for sure able to, to fix the this huh. issue. Yeah, let's see, let's see. Okay, so uh, let me know when you see my screen. Okay. Okay, so this is your VM, right? Virtual machine. Uh, so this, yeah. here, this is Windows one, right? Yes, exactly. Yes, and exactly. Okay, 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 okay. So in the networking, okay, but this is just for test. But since my let's say my AD port was up and it, it was working, so like I said, okay, maybe I'll, I could just add the port here. But it didn't yeah. work, so I created a new rule for the for this um, fifteen twenty one, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. then for fifty uh, fifty five zero two. But uh, I did that when I tried to to ping my VM here. Uh, the port is still closed. If I tried the eighty, it is open, but uh, the other one are closed. So. Uh, you see the eighty is open, but yeah. uh, my fifteen twenty one is still closed. Yeah. Ah. Okay. 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 Yeah. I can see. So what so you can do is, uh, so uh, yeah, okay. So let's check. Uh, yeah, can we do one thing uh, for testing purposes? Can we can we just disable the firewall for a moment? I mean, just just for one moment in order to check whether we are getting a block from the firewall. Is it okay for you? Yes, yeah, definitely. We already okay. tried that, but we can do that again. But we can. Uh, we can yeah, because uh, the, from that actually we can uh, confirm without troubleshooting within the uh, rule. We can actually, uh, you know, uh, we can. Uh, uh, you know, confirm that this is, uh, you know, getting blocked from the firewall or not. Uh, actually, I'm just, uh, for a moment, I'm just disabling. I think okay. it'll confirm us. Uh, let me uh, go with the, uh, okay, uh, domain profile, public and also public profile. And I'm just disabling all three. Okay, uh, let me click okay. Okay, so uh, a moment. Uh, okay, now uh, everything is disabled uh, with regards to firewall. Uh, could you please uh, check it from that? Uh, uh, you know this uh, website, uh, whatever the website you're using. Yeah. Ah, no, it's see, it's, it's still closed. Yeah, yeah. There, there should be some issue. I think the the problem is not the firewall. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, uh, is there any possibility that can, can we install uh, this software called, uh, you know, Wireshark? Uh, actually, you know, we are, we are just using in, in order to get a packet capture in order to get, check whether uh, we are receiving that request. Uh, is it okay for you uh, you to uh, download packet uh, Wireshark? Because then Wireshark, I can then, then I can uh, I mean I can remove it because I think using Wireshark it's somewhat easy for me to uh, you know get the packet capture and see whether we receive the request. So then if it is receiving, so then we can uh, find. Uh, Do you want me to install on the VM or on my personal machine? Sorry, uh, no, actually, uh, I need it within the VM. Uh, okay, 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 yeah. Yeah. I can that. Okay, I can remove that later. It is installed now. It is installed. Uh, one moment. Ah, yeah. Okay, okay, fine. So let me let me filter. Uh, we see a dot port. 
double equal it's uh, one five two one okay this is the one okay so what you can do is uh, okay otherwise uh, let me let me send the request from my end uh, using telnet so it's easy right uh, okay so here so ip one five two one are we getting anything i think we are getting it right yes. yeah actually we are getting yeah uh, we're getting the request right uh yeah yeah this is my ip yeah uh yeah we are getting it so what's the problem uh okay this is the request let me open it it says transmission control protocol okay uh it's reset ah okay okay uh, the problem is actually uh, what is your name what is your name actually i, I forgot to ask your name uh, osman osman Osman, Osman. Actually, uh, what I can see is uh, from here, you see, it's when it comes to TCP, so that is the uh, port level, uh, you know, when it comes to OSI, uh, open, uh, open standard, I mean, the OSI model, uh, we have layers. So we have TCP, uh, we, we have trans, uh, uh, I mean, we, we have transport layer. In transport layer, we have, uh, you know, TCP, TCP means transmission control protocol. So in TCP, actually, we have port numbers. Actually, here, our port is, uh, uh, what do you call, uh, TCP port is our 1521, right? So 1521 and I can see it is reset is sending back to the machine. I mean, reset is reset means uh, one moment. This is the request actually. Uh, let me check it first. Uh, okay. Uh, here actually uh, we are we are we are sending a sync sync packet uh, when it comes to tcp we are normally send the same because when it comes to uh, tcp we have a three-way handshake uh, initially the the client is sending a sync and the synac is going to be sent back from the server and uh, ACK is again sent by the client so then the connection is established so that's a tcp way of uh, establishing connection so here you can see the source port number is 526226 uh, right and essential port is 1521 so that means we are receiving the sync from my client or my talent request and the problem is actually when it comes to the respond here you can see there's a reset reset means uh, it is rejecting the connection uh, within your uh, host it is rejecting the connection so that is the problem that means your firewall is fine your security group is fine so okay. but the problem is within the oracle the connection is rejecting for some reason okay. this is the reset okay. i can reset so okay. that means uh, as i already told you could you please check from the oracle end i'll i'll i'll, I'll help you because no issues because it is not related to my mind but i'll help you because i i like i like to also know what the reason with the oracle because the oracle okay. is rejecting the connection okay okay and for yeah, the yeah. other it wasn't reset and act what was like when you come back here it was a scene okay yeah scene scene is from actually the the okay let, let me let, could you please open your uh the ms paint window uh, let, let me let me uh, draw, draw it here okay. i can i can draw and i can tell you so then you can understand actually i have a writing pad because actually i do classes okay, uh, okay. i do uh, firewall classes <laughs> okay so really? i like okay. to teach that's amazing okay <laughs> yeah. I, I, even the way you, you speak like a uh, house feeling that you're you're a teacher actually so <laughs> <laughs> yeah 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 actually teaching is a nice thing uh it's you know i actually you know I, I like to teach. <laughs> uh, from, okay, since okay. 2010, I've been teaching. Okay, okay well, amazing. And yeah, you, so. you just go, like you, you focus on firewall and you or you teach many things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, let me get my uh, writing uh, pen. Okay. So here, this is the case. Uh, uh, always ah okay okay so then i think uh let me share my screen because otherwise i can't write right using okay, uh, okay, uh, could you please uh, stop sharing from your end so then i can start my whiteboard and i can uh, sure. uh give you the idea because actually when it comes to troubleshooting actually you know we have to go logically right we have to check logically sometimes it takes days uh, you can see my screen right yes right yes here's uh this is uh this is the uh, no this is the client Okay. this is the client and this is your server actually this is the oracle server yeah. and what happens is when it comes to tcp uh, it is transmission control protocol actually it sends a uh, you know three-way handshake because actually this is a reliable uh, communication using tcp because we have two things we have tcp and we have udp uh, udp means it's a user data gun protocol this is not reliable but this is reliable so in that case actually we have something called three-way handshake 
So from the client, what the client does is client send the first packet, it says C. Uh, its C packet is going to be sent. And uh, then uh, the what server is going to do is uh, service is going to send a CNAC. Okay. CNAC. So that means uh, it says, okay, uh, my port is open. So you can, uh, you know, you can communicate with me. So then the client is going to finally send his ACK. Uh, acknowledgement packet again but unfortunately in your case in the second step what we can see is we can see it's not CNAC but it says reset, reset tag reset mm -hmm. the RST means reset tag so reset mm -hmm. tag means the service responding okay I'm here but the problem is I cannot accept your connection in in due to certain reasons it's gonna reset your connection so that's what happened here so the, the that that means actually the problem is not within the security group of the azure not within the firewall but within the oracle in some some reason oracle is resetting the connection so to, what we have to do is from the oracle side we have to check why this is getting reset so uh, let, okay. let me let me show you that uh, let, let me stop sharing from my end let me sh show you the the port 81 so then you can compile it uh let me uh, uh let me uh, stop sharing you can share your screen okay yes okay uh let me uh let me change the filter let me request uh, the connection uh, request remote control first okay okay uh okay let me change this to port 80. i think you can uh, keep this uh why shark i think it's uh, important for you too you know. yes yes until i found the so the, the reason why oracle is like he is blocking my phone let me send you the request for data okay i sent you request uh, so let me continue and uh, i think it's better let me filter my ip otherwise it's somewhat difficult because so many requests are coming uh, ip address ip source the requests. Uh, let me check my ip and type it here what is my IP? Okay. Could you please type uh, while I'm, uh, you know, uh, telling it uh, yes, the IP? One 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 two dot. Yes. Uh, one three four dot. Yes. One six one dot. Yes. One three one. Uh, please enter. Okay okay see now here we can see uh the requests are coming here uh let me open it uh it's a scene uh let me check whether the second one uh, that we have uh, see it's act yes you can understand right it's act not seen uh, not rst not rst reset. act yeah not a reset one that pro that's a problem actually uh, let me check something from here okay so that's a problem actually you know it's getting denied from the uh okay uh, let me send you some other request i want to see something okay ip source uh okay one more, one more actually uh you know ip not source uh, ip dst because actually that tech is from uh actually no, that's a not one uh no, not the actually uh osman uh, that is the <laughs> that is not the one because actually miss time is taken let uh, show you that one actually this is the one actually this is the correct one because actually that one is act the final act uh this is the correct okay. one this it says uh in uh in tcp uh, tcp uh here it says uh okay where's the one control protocol uh, uh this is a synac see this is the one actually uh, i'm really sorry because the previous one is act that is the final step because initially the client is or my machine is sending a scene and your machine is sending back synac and my machine again sending act so that's I what see. i saw i saw uh, i showed to you previously because i mistakenly because actually the previous the filter was ip dos yes. src but actually this is destination from your end actually my ip is a destination right mm -hmm. so this yes. is the correct one cnac but in your case we see rstac and it's yes. also it is not blue color it's a uh, yellow color so that means there's an issue with that mm -hmm. so actually that is the reason uh, your connection is not working so that means you don't have to worry about the azure security group and you do okay. not have to worry about the windows firewall okay. but you have to worry about your <laughs> okay oracle system 
Could you please open the net manager? You have something called net manager, right? You think Oracle? Uh, can net you, manager. Yeah, from you know start uh, start menu. Can you net manager? Yeah, that's the one, right? Open it. Uh, okay, so uh, let me open. Uh, listeners, uh, Osman, uh, is it okay for you? Could you please uh, uh, change this IP, uh, the host uh, to the uh, your whatever your IP, the 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 actual IP of the IP means uh, your one. private IP. Yeah, not the public one. Could you please change it to the private IP of the? Because I'm quite, I'm not. Uh, you know, from the Azure, you can see the private IP, right? Uh, your okay. private IP. Let me see that. Uh, yeah. Know. Okay. Work, I don't uh, see that because uh, yeah, I think this one 10004, right? Uh, the below networking 10004, it's your private IP. Uh, here, uh, yeah, yeah, here, this one. Okay, 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 okay. So, yeah. Because actually, the request is coming for uh, this IP, so I'm uh, highly doubt to uh, the problem with this uh, local hosting. So, uh, could it be changed and you can. Uh, a, a well, how to ch how to change it? Uh, you have to stop and start, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, since it's yeah, already stopped. Yeah. It's the command I was using to, to look at the status. Well, uh, we can start that. Uh, okay. okay. So then I think we can start it. Let's just verify the status. Uh, no status. Okay. 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 Uh, it is here, no okay. listener. No listener. And then now we can see. Successful. Uh, but Osman, then could you please run that command that you previously run in order to show me the uh, the port numbers and all? I think the status one, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Because I just want to check whether it is listening on the uh, one zero zero something that we configured. Uh, uh, it uh, says uh, local house. It's fine. Uh, don't we have that? Uh, uh, ah, it's listening on ten ten zero zero. Okay. Let me check from my end whether we can. Uh, uh, let's see whether we have. Okay, now it's fine. Oh, wow. Okay, now it's fine, right? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, really? Thank you. <laughs> okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, I, I spent two days on that. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate your help. Oh, okay, I, okay. I, for sure, hundred percent our tips there. So I'm really thankful. Thank you so much. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Have a good day. And for sure, I'll keep you. I, I I'll keep you your contact. If any any anything networking, for sure, I'll contact you again. Yeah, sure, sure, awesome. Okay, thank you for your comment. Okay, thank Have you a so nice much. Day. Bye bye. Okay, okay, bye bye. Thanks, yeah. thanks. Okay. So as you can see in this actual troubleshooting session, we used TCP three way handshake in order to troubleshoot port Texas issue. So thank you for watching and I hope this will help you for your troubleshooting as well. Please like and subscribe to Fire Life.